here. This is a this is a good matchup here. You got Goofy versus regular Matt Wilkinson, the vet. Michael Rodriguez coming on as a rookie. So a uh, way to start your day with a matchup like this. And this one on paper, real tough to call. Return to form. We've got Federico Moraes, Pakadowskis. And to start this heat off, here we go. Michael Rodriguez with priority. Big snap to start us off. He's got this mid-ranger here. Kind of trying to time this thing. Almost looking like he was going to go to the air. Bypasses that section. A lot of the time you're right, you're going along the face of the wave, trying to work out what you want to do. On your backhand, it kind of simplifies things with that big backside snap at Emrod. You can see, looking for the barrel. Now he kind of was thinking, oh, maybe in air. I thought he was definitely going to go to the air there. That wave didn't really show any opportunity. So beautiful opening maneuver from Emrod. Um, priority now with Matty Wilco, but Michael Rodriguez, I love that. As soon as he gets that stance getting a bit wider, a bit wider, you know something crazy is going to happen. Or is throwing out scores. What do they do to kind of shuffle? Well, we'll see what they do right here as we see Michael Rodriguez, his second wave. So without priority, almost looked like he was coiling up for the ramp. And I think if we're at the end of this heat, yep. most likely would have seen a big release there from Rodriguez. We call it the main site. The uh, where we started off this event about four days ago. So you see, we've moved down the beach and will this suit the style of Matt Wilkinson? Drops in on a nice sized right, straight up into the lip and out. So one turn for Matt Wilkinson. His first wave of the heat was 17 minutes and 55 seconds to go. Let's we'll see if that will better the uh, opening wave of Michael Rodriguez. Was, was a two, so humble beginnings for both of our surfers, but both of, both of these guys engaged nonetheless. Yeah, absolutely. And that was that moment where you were asking me before, when do you pull the trigger? Well, Matty Wilco figured just inside that 20-minute mark, it's time to get going. Even though it wasn't a keeper, it's going to reposition him on the bank. And uh, while we're at the break, Rodriguez, a nice little in and out. So that's kind of what we're, uh, we're expecting. Maybe get that tube ride, sneak out a little earlier and go to the air, but deciding to pull through the back there from Rodriguez. So... 3.07, currently leading the heat with a three and a two, so no, no big scores just yet. Here we go, live action on his backhand. Matt Wilkinson pulls up high and tight Ooh. and gets blown up. Wow. As the backwash came at an inopportune time, right as the lip was coming down, the backwash came up. Wilco was not in a good spot. We'll see, uh, keep our eyeballs on Wilco. He looks all right. On to one now as Rodriguez steep, deep in the pit, utilizing that wedge takeoff, comes around this section, lays into a slicing cutback straight up into the white water. Now Rodriguez looks like he's uh, kind of adding to the effect of each and every wave, improving on his scores. His last wave came through a 3.07. So of note, this wave, relatively new. Yep. 2014 when this jetty was built. Yeah, exactly right. Um, you can see Rodriguez now kind of identifying the kind of wave he's looking for, right? And I think that's what happened with that uh, 3.07. He goes, okay, that's the kind of wave I need to look for. It's got the right little bump coming off the rocks. It's more the, the medium-sized one, not the real big ones. The big one's a little straight at the moment. But Rodriguez, not a deep barrel. I'm not seeing this go too high, but there's a little bit of a insight on this kid here. He's got that beautiful rail game, nice style. Looks really solid on his feet, and he's starting to warm up. And uh, here goes Rodriguez on a bigger wave, deeper barrel, oh. <laughs> too deep, pumping into oblivion. I like that, though. Great view there of what this lineup looks like. And here we go, Matt Wilkinson grabbing the rail. Trying to stall into this pocket. He does get under it. Now he's got to get out of it. Surprised by the power down here in this corner pocket. Yeah, exactly right. I mean, it does pack a lot of punch, and you can see Matty Wilco trying to slow himself down. Definitely his best wave. Does he pull it off? You know, that's the danger of this wave. It's so abrupt. Um, it's so easy to hurt yourself. Let's have a look here. Beautiful snap off the top. And he goes for that. Oh, an awkward landing from Rodriguez. Beautiful snap. And then he goes up into the lip. He lands. Pulls it off. Points at the crowd. About a 95% make. Yeah. <laughs> he kind yeah. of sold the make to the judges. Try to sell the make. Exactly right. Is this the final opportunity for Matt Wilkinson? 35 seconds. Michael Rodriguez now finds a peak up the beach, straightens off. 
He's going to leave Wilco up to his own devices outside in the lineup with 25 seconds to go. This is a could be a crushing defeat for Matt Wilkinson, who will have to figure out how to get his season back on track with 13 seconds to go. I don't think he's going to have a chance. It's that sinking feeling, Chris. Uh, and you start thinking back on what could I have done? How could I have changed that? He did sit for quite a bit of time at the beginning of the heat until he opened his account. So maybe that came into play for Matt Wilkinson. But the local favorite, Michael Rodriguez, moves through. And another 25th for Matty Wilco.